Hey, it's Thomas here, and today we're gonna to be taking a look at Ice Cap's CO2 scrubber. If you want a simple, compact, and easy to install CO2 scrubber for your protein skimmer with a mounting bracket to hang it on your tank or sump that will help you in that battle against chronically low pH and help get your pH up to that sweet spot to accelerate the growth of your corals, then check out Ice Cap's CO2 scrubber. Managing pH in our reef tanks is important for maintaining coral growth. It's no secret that a low pH makes it difficult for corals to grow, while higher pH levels around 8.3 can result in accelerated coral growth. One of the most common hurdles to maintaining a higher pH level is CO2. Atmospheric CO2 in your home finds its way into your tank through gas exchange, and one of the largest contributors to your aquarium's gas exchange is your protein skimmer, making it a great place to take action. Adding a CO2 scrubber to your protein skimmer's air intake can be one of the easiest ways to get a bump in pH to get your tank into that sweet spot for accelerated coral growth by removing that excess CO2 before it makes it into your aquarium. Ice Cap Scrubber is a great option for those looking for a compact, purpose-built scrubber to add on to a protein skimmer. In the box, you'll find the Ice Cap CO2 Scrubber and one kilogram of Ice Cap color-changing CO2 scrubbing media. It comes in three sizes, a small, a medium, and a large that hold 1.2, 2.2, and 4.4 pounds of CO2 absorbing media, respectively. The small unit that I've got here is pretty compact at roughly four and a half by four and a half by six and a half inches tall, not including the hanging bracket, which makes it a good option for nano reefers or anyone who wants to use a CO2 scrubber but is really tight on space. The large unit has a substantial capacity while still being reasonably sized, making it a good option for those who have a higher CO2 level in the room and go through CO2 media faster or who just wanna change out that media less often. To fill these CO2 scrubbers, there is a hatch on the top that's held on with a few nylon screws. Take it off, fill the chamber with media, and put it back on. I'm really glad to see that they used an O-ring here as well to make sure that the air is only drawn through the inlet port on the top. So if you run the inlet tubing outside or in another inline configuration, you don't get any bypass or air seeping in around the cover. Installing the scrubber is just a matter of taking the air intake tube off of the skimmer's air silencer and attaching it to the rigid tubing in the push connect fitting on the scrubber. Ice Cap included a push connector for both the air intake and output on the scrubber, so if you prefer to draw air from outside of the stand or want to run it in between the venturi and air silencer or any other inline configuration, you can. I've been using CO2 media to help raise pH on my own aquariums for years now, and it can do a phenomenal job, but that isn't the only factor you're gonna wanna consider if you're trying to remedy a chronically low pH. Thankfully, Ryan has an awesome master series on pH. You can check it out right here. Goes over pH in depth, the ins and outs of what will affect pH and what pH will affect, and basically gives you all the tools you need to try and figure out how to maintain that sweet spot in pH for maximum coral growth so that you can practically watch your corals grow day by day, which I mean, who doesn't want that? So go ahead, have a watch. This may be the solution, uh, but it might, you know, work better in conjunction with some other things too. So go, go get that pH, go get that 8.3. Find it.